lip tutorial. Now, usually with this eye look that I'm going to share with you guys, with a classic red lip, it usually, usually is worn with red lipstick. Like, if I am looking at pictures online and seeing different things, it usually is the lip. I'm just saying, it's usually the lip. <laughs> so, the lipstick that I'm using today is so affordable. And I wanted to go ahead and throw it out there to you guys that it is so affordable. So, please go out and go get it. It's for right. itself. And it is their dollar lipstick. And it looks like this. A lipstick with that much pigmentation, you guys. For a dollar? Hmm. So this lipstick is in a shade called Fearless, and Fearless can be found everywhere, like literally. Every time I went to a makeup department and they had L or to a drugstore, Fearless was there. Like Fearless is gonna be their number to one lipstick at the drugstore. So please go out, go out, and go get you some of this Fearless because it is definitely, you know, the type of lipstick you need to have in your collection it's like just amazing so, um yeah i hope you guys enjoy and let's get this video up to 25 likes if we possibly can or more than that you know i'm just trying to see if my peeps are interacting with me because i love interacting with you guys but if you guys want more videos then please all you have to do is hit that subscribe button it's free so subscribe for free, I guess. And let's go ahead and get started. Okay, Pete. So, before we get started, we're gonna take an eyeshadow primer. And y'all know how much I love Max Paint Pot and Penalty. So I'm not gonna get in depth, but if you are a new viewer, then yes, I love Pam Matt Paint Pot and Penalty. It's the best. And I also do use other eyeshadow primers on this channel as well. And I'm going to take it and I'm going to apply it to the eyes. So now the shadows that I am using in this tutorial is affordable. So please don't think I'm all about the high end. Which I like high end but I love drugstore. So I'm taking the Walking on Eggshells palette from Wet n Wild Cosmetics. And I'm going to take the first shade using an LA Girl Cosmetics eyeshadow brush. And I'm going to take the first shade which is says eyebrow <laughs> or brow bone. And I'm gonna apply it to the lid first. I remember doing this look for the holidays, if I'm not mistaken, but it has like a little vampy twist because when I did it, it had like a vamp look to it. It was more dramatic, but over the years, it's like a classic red lip with this combination. Amazing. Okay, you guys. So now I'm gonna take, of course, this Judy Fine palette, which I love. Judy, I'm so glad you came out with the palette, girl, because it's amazing. <laughs> I'm going to take it, and I'm going to take that brown. I always use that brown. I've noticed in every tutorial, I always use that brown. And I'm going to take the brown, I'm going to apply it to my cre crease as a transition color. Then the next shade I'm going to take is the vanilla shade. Excuse me, the brown shade. I'm going to take the brown shade, and I'm going to apply the brown shade to give a little bit more definition. Usually I use black. But with a classic red lip, this brown shade is just amazing. It would be over the top if I use that black. So I'm going to take the brown. I'm going to say black. And I'm going to take the brown and I'm going to apply it to the crease. Now after I apply that to the crease, I'm going to be taking is the, the vanilla shade. The vanilla shade is going to be used as our brow bow highlight. Take the old whatever shade that you have or whatever, whatever eyeshadow you have. I'm going to take that and I'm going to apply it as our brow bow highlight. I thought I'd take that and apply it as our brow bone highlight and also in the inner corner because it's going to brighten up the eyes. If you apply that shade in our, your inner corner, it's really going to brighten it up. After that, I am going to be lining the eyes with a different method this time. I always use the one of cream, but before the cream, I was using the liquid. And the liquid is in the shade called Black and it's from e.l.f. Hands down, I truly, really love this. It's so amazing. And it's just great. So I'm going to be taking this and I'm going to be applying it halfway, not fully in. Because this one gave me the most problems. And liquid eyeliners in general give me the most problems. 
and whenever I am trying to apply liquid eyeliner it just you know gets all of my eyes like comment below if you had that problem when you're getting ready in the morning you're trying to get ready and you're trying to leave out the door and then you're wearing a lip glow eyeliner and it gets it takes forever to dry <laughs> so I'm just gonna be taking my mascara my favorite at the moment is Maybelline the Barca Express mascara volume express mascara to be exact I'm gonna take it and apply it to my lashes and I'm gonna apply it to those baby lashes as well so you cannot forget those either this mascara is thebomb.com thebomb.com okay all right <laughs> so after I apply a few couple coats to my lashes to get that glamorous look <laughs> I am going to be applying from Elf Cosmetics. This is their blush palette. Yes, they have a blush palette. I do have a review. So if you want a review, then it will be listed in the description box below. So I'm going to be taking that blush palette, taking that color that I showed you guys. So I'm just going to apply it. Now with this palette here, don't get me wrong. Elf may be not expensive, but the pigmentation makes it look like it's about a $40 blush. So be very careful. One tap is basically what you're going to really need for this blush, guys. Then after that, I'm going to kind of blend because with this blush, it's kind of like a muggy type. But it, it once you blend it and get the right texture you want, you won't have any problems. Then I'm going to take Physicians Formula Highlighter and I'm going to be applying that to the areas where I highlight usual. And to get the highlighter on fleek, use that strobe method. <laughs> So, Miss Lynn has a video on all about strobing, so go check out Miss Lynn's video on strobing and what it is. And I just love it. So, the main part of this video is coming from this lipstick right here from Elf Cosmetics. It is called, da 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 da, it is like the best. So, this lipstick that I'm going to share with you guys is called Fearless. When I say this lipstick is like the bomb.com, you cannot beat this lipstick with a stick. Like, this lipstick is a dollar. It applies very well with or without moisturizer. It's not glossy because I do have moisturizer. But if you apply a matte, oh my gosh, it's just great. So here is the final look. So here is the complete look. I hope you guys enjoyed it. So I hope you guys enjoyed this video. Thumbs this video up and comment below what videos would you like to see next. And I'll talk to you soon.